What's going on guys? It's Azure here. Welcome back to my let's play of Naruto Ultimate Ninja on the PlayStation 2. Last time we met up, we completed Sasuke Uchiha's story, and before that we had completed the main character of the series, Naruto Uzumaki. Naruto Uzumaki. This time around though, we're going to be wrapping things up for Team Kakashi here by playing as not the teacher though, but Sakura. The often looked over, the often overlooked member of Squad 7, but for me though, Sakura is one shining star. And so if you like what you see here guys, and want to be a... Uh, I would love to see me play through more anime type games like this for you in the future, not just Naruto related of course, but Dragon Ball and anything, uh, and anything else really under the sun as well. Just be sure to let me know though, down below in the comments section, your favorite moment of this uh, Let's Play here. And also, uh, perhaps your favorite part, or uh, your favorite, and also perhaps your favorite character or fight from the series if you've seen the original series or read the manga. Also, though, in addition, if you really like me, <laughs> and and also though, in addition, if you really like me and want to support the channel here, be sure be sure to subscribe down below and to enable the notifications by ringing that bell icon. That way, you guys will get every that that way you guys will get every. Uh, that way, you guys will get instantly notified on everything I've got coming out for you all. And so with that all being said here, why don't we begin Sakura's story. Sakura Haru no Sada. Now then, the story begins. Okay guys, so like I said, this time around though, in uh, Ultimate Ninja here, we'll be playing as Sakura from Squad 7. And so far at least here, well, things are looking pretty darn good. As we show Kakashi Sensei here that we're more than capable of being a ninja. Look at that speed. And that power. Cha! Not cool, Sensei. Not cool. Gotcha, Sensei. Look up. I've got you now! That's dangerous! Cha, ah! yeah, I'm the best! <laughs> I thought you were the fastest in the leaf. Ah, uh, darn it, come on. Not Sasuke! Oh no! And away we go here. Let's change things up. Same trick again, Sensei. Why don't we show you a thing or two here? Cha! I can do it if I try. Good 
job. You pass. Xia! True love conquers all! That wasn't too bad of a uh, first battle here with Sakura, but why don't we see, though, who we're gonna be duking out with next as we move on to the second battle in her story. So, away we go! What a pest! The nuisance of love, Naruto Uzumaki! Don't worry, Sakura! Just forget about Sasuke! You and I can develop our teamwork all day! Naruto, you are so dead! Say, say! I'll show you that I'm cooler than that old Sasuke, believe it! Then show me your ability! Here I go! Yeah, that's right! Okay, I'm gonna fight, believe it! So far here, guys, it seems like we're really uh, cleaning Naruto's clock. I do say so myself. He may be a knucklehead, but he can definitely take quite a beating. So that's really uh, saying something about his ability. Jeez, Louise. Jeez, what's his problem? You can do it! And he keeps dodging our shurikens here too, it's kind of annoying. Come on, Naruto, what are you doing? I think you should be sent back to the academy. You're the weakest link here in Squad 7 after all. See? That's what I'm talking about right there. You're just gonna slow us all down in missions. When we're out in the uh, ninja world here. What a pest. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> fooled you right there. Let's try harder than that. <laughs> oh, what? Come on. Alright, that's it. Let's see if you can handle this one. Here I go. Now let's wrap this up. You can do it. Not lose. I will not lose. Bring it on. Yeah, that's right, Sakura! I come through when I need to. Naruto, are you okay? Jeez, it's because you go too far. Wow! Way to go, Sakura! I always knew you were awesome! Believe it! Naruto, sure enough, you're not any good. Okay guys, so that was a honestly uh, pretty uh, back and forth battle with Sakura, but let's see though just who we're going to be duking out against this time around. And so let's continue her story. And so let's continue her story. Don't mock a woman's ability! Up and 
Okay, guys, so this would be an interesting match as we fight against Shikamaru of the Nara clan. And his, and his special ability consists of him actually being able to trap us with his shadow on the ground and attack us basically in any kind of way, like via his weapons, such as, you know, Senbon or Kunai, and just really put us in a uh, really bad position. But yeah, so Shikamaru is actually a really cool character. He gets a lot of development throughout the series as it progresses on, and he gets a lot more screen time, so. And he actually becomes a very important side character as well in the later arcs, so. Shikamaru is actually one of my favorites as well, for what it's worth. So hopefully we'll be able to play as him in story mode here as well. <laughs> Oh jeez, that was cool. Whoa! His teammate just came out and helped us there. Gotcha. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like this is the end for you. I've got you now! That's dangerous! Sha, <laughs> I'm the best! I'm not always just a hindrance. Man, such a drag. That's it. I give up. Sha! Feels good! Wow, <laughs> that was a pretty quick battle there, to say the least, against uh, Shikamaru here. So, with that battle behind us now, why don't we move on to our next match with Sakura. Mysterious assassin! Hidden Miss Village Ninja, Haku! What a pretty kid! Is this kid a shinobi too? Never know until you try. Yeah, feels good. I don't want to kill you, but Alright, so this time around here, everyone, we'll be squaring off against Haku, the Mist Ninja Assassin. Who was one of the main antagonists in the first part of the Naruto series. So this will be very interesting here though guys, to see how we do against Taku. And he's just really blocking all our moves. This might be a long match. Yes! Gotcha! Looks like you were burned on that deal. No! No! Whew! Close call right there. Alright, let's see. How should we finish off Haku here? Yeah, you know what? I want to go for the uh, level 3 Jutsu move. So why don't we try that? No, no, no! Jump up, jump, jump, no, jump, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. Things are good, things are fine, things are good. Alright, let's go, Haku. Let's see what you got. What? Running away? No! Okay, 
no worries. All we have to do is charge up our chakra again. Yes, Sasuke coming through again. Our main man, I guess you could say. What was it? Make Naruto then, though. <laughs> Alright, slowed you down, Haku. Now, why don't you come over here and uh, let me tell you a secret. Yes! That's what I like to see. Here I go! <laughs> I got you! Ah! I cannot lose! Things will get ugly! You make me angry! Ah! So, now do you see? Haku. All right, Haku, so you may be down, but I know you're not out. Let's see if you uh, got what it takes to be a true shinobi. Come on, bring it! Gotcha! Now, this is the end! And looks like your plans have been squashed. Well, guys, that was <laughs> that was actually the most interesting battle so far in this uh, story mode here for Sakura. Not to mention the first one though against Kakashi, of course. But that one was a close second. If I'd have to uh, rank them here in terms of how much I've enjoyed them. Protect the bridge. Hidden Miss Village Ogre Zabaza is here. Hereafter. Okay, so it looks like we're fighting Zabuza here? Okay, I guess. Um, I was not expecting this, guys. Honestly, um, especially as Sakura. I was thinking more like when we played as perhaps Naruto or, you know, maybe Sasuke or something. But, yeah. Gotcha! Gotcha! Serves you right for underestimating our power as a shinobi. Aw, oh, come on. So, Zabuza's not doing too good here for uh, assassin and all that. Not really all that powerful. Yeah, yeah, you heard Haku. You shouldn't lose Zabuza, but it looks like you're gonna lose. Hey, come on, bro. Step up. Oh, that was so cool. I love how we can jump on these, uh, I guess these, like, wires here or strings. Go like that. Jump up on the tree. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, this stage is really, 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 really fun. Finally get some more interesting stages in this game to uh, battle on. Come on. There we go. Once you finally stop blocking us, we can get our cool little moves in. Chia. Alright, what you gonna do? Come on, Zabuza. What are you afraid of? Let's see if we can get you with this. Gotcha! That's time number two. Let's go, Sasuke. All right, here we go. What? 
Oh, come on. Darn it. Now, this will end it. Look up. I've got you now. That's dangerous. I'm the best. I'll kill you. Okay, so uh, that battle was actually pretty good as well. We definitely showed Zabuza a thing or two after sending Haku packing to the afterlife, it would seem. As uh, Sakura is apparently the main character now. <laughs> well, wouldn't that be something though? If there was a little side series about Sakura being the main character instead and what the series was like through her perspective? The strength of the curse! Sasuke's rampage! Alright, it's only the power flowing through me. I'm an Avenger. To follow my path, I must have power at any price, even if it means being consumed by evil. No, it's not. It can't be. Whoever that is, it's not Sasuke. I won't let anyone stand in my way, even you. Bring it on. Okay, guys. So this time around, it looks like we're fighting against Sasuke, and I guess he's supposed to be taken over by the curse mark that was placed on his neck by Orochimaru during the Chunin exams here. So basically, Sasuke is, I guess you could say, kind of evil, but also not evil. Like, he is, but he also at the same time isn't. It's kind of complicated if you really think about it too hard. Um, but yeah, so Sasuke has a pretty big power boost here, it would seem. Kind of like a transformation. And is trying to, I guess, destroy Sakura. There we go. Sorry about this, Sasuke. Ouch, that hurt. Some teammate you are. Alright, let's try that again. Or, maybe not. <laughs> oh well. Oh, no, no, no. Please don't change stages. Yeah, so anytime either player in this game changes the stages like that and they have the option to, well, to do so, they get an automatic health boost. But that, I believe, only happens the first time around. So, with that being said, yeah, you have to try and stop Sasuke from doing that. No! Oh, I couldn't even get out of that combo. I was stuck in it. Jeez. Oh, come on. Alright, so let's see. How can we distract Sasuke here? That didn't work. And we're slowed down. Great. Come on. Are we going to defeat Sasuke here now? Alright, we got back to full chakra. That's one good thing at least. Chakra recovery! Is that the best you can do? I've got to help! Gotcha, Sasuke! I will not lose! Bring it on!
am I?